With all the buzz surrounding artificial intelligence, robots, self-driving cars, etc., it's simple to believe that it has little relevance to our day-to-day -day activities. In reality, the majority of us come into contact with AI in some way virtually every day. AI has rapidly gotten into our daily lives from the moment you get up to check your smartphone to viewing an other Netflix-suggested movie. The worldwide AI market is expected to rise up to 54% annually, according to a Sinista analysis. But what is AI exactly? Will it benefit humanity in the long run? Well, we'll talk about some of the numerous downsides of artificial intelligence in this video. But before we delve into that, we welcome you to AI Evolve's channel, where we provide you with the latest updates and news from around the world. So without further ado, let's get started. Wait, don't forget to like this video, subscribe and press the notification bell icon so you won't miss any updates from our channel. What is artificial intelligence? Let's first establish what artificial intelligence is before moving on to its limitations. From an elevated perspective, AI gives a computer program the capacity to think for itself and learn independently. It is the artificial simulation of human intellect and robots that do tasks for which we would typically turn to humans. Based on their capabilities, weak, strong, and super AI are the three major types of AI. Weak AI is known for concentrating on a single task and is incapable of completing other tasks. Strong AI is capable of understanding and mastering every cognitive task that a person can. Researchers are working towards strong AI, and super AI can exceed human intelligence and is superior to humans at every task. Let's move on to the various downsides of this. Number one, AI can yield biased results. The fact that AI algorithms are created by people means that they may unintentionally or intentionally contain biases. AI algorithms will yield biased results if they were developed with a bias or if the data used as training sets for the algorithms was biased. This reality may have unforeseen repercussions, similar to those brought on by prejudiced hiring behaviors and Microsoft's own racist Twitter chatbot. AI algorithms must be created and trained appropriately as businesses develop them to avoid biased results. Number two, the loss of several jobs. There will be several employment generated by artificial intelligence and many people forecast a net gain in jobs or at least anticipate the same number to be created to replace the ones that are lost as a result of AI technology. But there will also be tasks that people currently do that robots will eventually take over. As a result, training and educational programs will need to evolve to better prepare for the next generation of workers and assist current employees in transferring to new jobs that will make use of their particular human qualities. Number 3. Change in the human experience The additional flexibility might initially appear like a utopia if AI takes over menial chores and permits humans to dramatically cut the amount of time they must spend at a job. Humans will need to use their newfound freedom to engage in new hobbies that offer them the same social and mental advantages that their jobs did to feel like their lives have meaning. Some people in communities might find this easier than others. When machines take over tasks that humans used to be paid to do, there will probably also be economic factors to take into account. This can result in a downside for people who lack financial security and are vulnerable. Therefore, this shift of human experience can either lead to chaos in the economy or a positive experience for all. On the profit and loss accounts of companies, the fiscal benefits of improved efficiencies are very obvious, but the wider advantages to society and the human condition are a little less apparent. Number 4. Global Boundaries While technology has made the globe smaller than it has ever been, this also implies that new laws and regulations governing AI technologies will need to be agreed upon among various countries to permit secure and productive cross-border interactions. Since we are no longer in a vacuum, it is very easy for one country's artificial intelligence policies to hurt others. We can already see how this will play out. Whereas the US and particularly China allow their corporations to use AI much more leniently, Europe has established a solid regulatory approach to assure constant and accessibility. Number 5. Hacking in rapid speed Artificial intelligence accelerates progress and in many circumstances surpasses our capacity for understanding as humans. Automation makes it more difficult for humans to detect evil deeds like phishing, the introduction of viruses into software, and the manipulation of AI systems for personal gain due to the way these systems see the world. Number 6. Terrorism of AI Similar to this, there might be emerging AI-enabled forms of terrorism to contend with, such as the development of autonomous drones and robotic swarms, remote attacks, or disease delivery by nanorobots. The potential harm that this will pose will require adjustments from our law enforcement and defense organizations. 
to make sure that even though there is a chance for negative effects, with its continued adoption, they are reduced as much as possible. It will take time and extensive human reasoning to figure out the best method to get ready for a future with even more artificial intelligence applications. These are difficult problems to resolve, as is the case with every disruptive event. But as long as humans continue to participate in problem solving, we will be able to gain an advantage from artificial intelligence many positive aspects, while minimizing its negative effects. Number 7. Privacy Invasion Privacy is one of the main issues with AI. We can no longer avoid AI because we rely on it. The global reach of technology has introduced us to AI in every region of the world. Due to AI's heightened surveillance, which mimics Big Brother, in that it constantly monitors us and keeps tabs on the data we use, we are under more scrutiny than ever. For instance, we see shoe adverts on a social media application the moment we leave an e-commerce website where we were looking for shoes. AI thus influences human decisions in a variety of ways, in ways that we are completely unaware of. It also sticks clear to our environments. Home smart speakers like Alexa and Google Home operate via voice commands and are aware of the user's daily routine. Biometric data and iris detection are also used by phones. As a result, AI has access to all our private information. Number 8. AI Controlling Freedom of Speech The majority of information we now acquire is online or via social media. We can be under the control of social media networks or other intermediaries. As a result, sometimes we cannot make an informed decision because these platforms present us with a biased narrative, which affects our right to free speech and expression. Although these challenges initially appear unrelated, a deeper inspection reveals that AI and freedom of expression are closely related. At the moment, technology tools influence how people communicate, access information, and exercise their right to free speech. For instance, AI can influence how people engage in these activities through search engines or social networks. Number 9. No Originality The inability of AI to learn to think creatively beyond the box is a significant drawback. With pre-fed data and prior experiences, AI can learn over time, but it is not capable of taking an innovative approach. The robot Quill, which can write Forbes earnings reports, is a prime example. Only information that has already been sent to the bot is contained in these reports. The fact that a bot can create an essay on its own is astounding. Yet, it lacks the human touch found in other Forbes pieces. Number 10. AI Making Humans Lazy AI programs automate the majority of tedious and repetitive work, making people lazy. We tend to engage our brains less and less because we do not need to memorize information or solve puzzles to complete tasks. Future generations may experience issues as a result of this AI addiction. It can also lead to mental illnesses if people become too addicted to this. They will stop using their brain independently and may struggle in practical life situations which do not require the use of AI. Number 11. Emotionless Behavior We have been educated from a young age that neither machines nor computers have feelings. Humans work as a team, and leading a team is crucial to accomplishing objectives. However, it is undeniable that when appropriately used, robots outperform people, but it is also true that human interactions, the foundation of teams, cannot be substituted by computers. Morality and ethics are significant human traits that can be challenging to include in an AI. Numerous people are worried that as AI develops quickly, humans will one day become completely exterminated by it. The AI singularity is at this point. As determined by the precise dangers posed by AI and how it would affect our way of life, much work needs to be done to regulate it and the way that individuals, private organizations and governmental bodies use it. Public sentiment and regulatory responses have been fairly quiet up until this point. Innovation is beneficial, yet it has also been shown to be destructive. AI does not currently exist. It can be only programmed, trained and used by humans. We have some degrees of control over it, and we can make it bend in any direction we like. Dealing with pandemics, climate change, and economic crisis can all benefit from it. On the other hand, if that software is utilized, trained, or constructed poorly, it can lead to various damages. So, this is it for today's video. What is your opinion on how will AI change the world, and whether will it be more beneficial or damaging? Let us know in the comments. If you enjoyed our video, don't forget to like and subscribe to the AI Evolves channel for more videos. Till then, take care of yourself, see you in the next video.